Hello everyone, my name is Tony Kletus. It's been a while you've seen me on this channel. Yes, and I'm back with a lot of tips. And today I just want to update you guys. Normally, if you don't want to always type node to start your application, you can actually use Nodemon. So Nodemon is like it automates the process for you, whereby it automatically restarts the node application when files changes in the directory without you actually going to type node app or node index to always run your node.js application node.js in the version 18.11.0 gave us a built-in flag that dash wash which you can actually use without installing node more this restarts the process when an imported file is changed without wasting much of your time i will show you how to use that but before I go to, into that, there's actually a tutorial here that explains Node Rush versus Node Mon. So I will drop this link in my description. You, you can go through it as well. This is the basic application, and I'm using Express Framework to run my server. Normally, what you do is where you, when you want to start this application, type since the file is in there, so that's Node in this, right? And when you do this, you can run the app, you know, it starts the server. So let's open this app and you have hello developers right so that's what i have there the home route but what even led to the creation of node more so let's say you, you make a change to your file here let's say you said hello world and you come back to browser nothing changes so you have to stop this process and you know type node in this again then that change you made just now will reflect because you have to restart your server so all you need to do instead of installing nodemon you can just go ahead and say node then the name of your file containing your server and that is it so you can see there's a warning here and you have just have to ignore it it said experimental warning this is still being experimented it's actually good i believe it's very useful and it's going to stay so when you do this you can come back here and you see you have your server running when I come here and make any changes like Tony Cletus, yeah, you see what's happening now. So it just restarted the server because of that change I made. You can refresh your page and you see the hello Tony Cletus again. So that's it. That's pretty much what I wanted to show you guys. So you can say that node dash dash word in this. You save this and that's it. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.